Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Guys, we are starting with the characteristics, good or bad, right? Who are they? Who are you dealing with? This could be somebody new. It could be somebody that you use to date. Maybe they say they've changed. Maybe you're trying to see if they're still that person. Or maybe you just think that some of these qualities are theirs, right? So the qualities, guys, could be good, bad, or indifferent. Hi. All right, guys. Characteristics. Who are they? Who are you dating? Who are you trying to get to know? Who are you trying to give another chance to? Have they changed? Yada, yada. Yada, yada, yada. All right. Let's see. I guess we can go with three, right? Let's go with three. Holy Spirit, what do you have for the characteristics? I'm going to let the cards pull, maybe. All right. Okay. Alright. Okay. It wanted to come out. Alright. We'll take these three. Well, on one side, guys, they're very positive, romantic, spiritual, and very generous. So they're very giving. They're very romantic. All of those things. They're positive and this and that. And then, and when I was flipping the deck, I saw hard working come out. So, this person is hardworking, they're employed, they have a job, they have a J-O-B. Uh, they're very focused and they're very diligent at the things that they do. They're, you know, they just they just work hard. So they're positive, they're romantic, they're spiritual, and very generous, which means they're very giving. But then we have critical. And critical says it's urgent and needing immediate attention. So it's critical, guys. They are on life uh port okay so it's like i need it and i need it now type of energy but other than that they're quite positive um and they just like attention they need they need immediate attention that could be good and bad because let's say you're with this person and for whatever reason you're working and you had to work overtime or something like that for three weeks you had to travel whatever it is that you had to do and because you're not there and they need immediate attention that could be a bad thing. You know what I mean? Like if you're not there to cater to their needs, what they gonna do, jump ship type energy? You know what I mean? Or they gonna do jump ship. So that urgent and needing immediate attention could be good and bad. But other than that, they're positive, romantic, spiritual, and generous. And they're hardworking, employed, focused, and diligent. So when they do what they got to do they do it and they do it well right and they're giver they're romantic all of those other things and spiritual so that's a plus all right guys we're doing bricks and pillows let's see if you're going to get a brick or some pillows from this person we're going to take three as well that hard work and focus and diligent is very good okay so the positive side the romantic side of them guys they said let's watch some movies and chill so they just want to relax you know chill with you have a little romance date. Have a little, you know, a little picnic at home. Let's see what else. Need some more bricks of pillows. Two more spirits. Should we try again? So this is someone that you know. So they're, they they want to know, should we try again? They could be thinking about it. Should we try again? You know, type energy. And then we have disappointed, upset, and thinking. So that can go with their criticalness here and urgent and needing attention. So they're disappointed in something. They're upset about something and they're thinking about something. So something is on their mind right now. They have some things going on. They need, it's critical. They need attention right now. Alright guys, let's go in, see what's going on with this person. What's going on with your person? What's going on? I'm going to slide these three just to give us more room. Don't forget guys, this could be a man or a woman. This is a ten of swords here. Um, 
I don't know if they're ending things with you or ending things in another situation. They could even feel like they've been stabbed in the back, right? Or they, you, we'll find out as we go. They're moving forward though. They want victory in their life. They're definitely moving forward. People are cheering them on. I don't know, maybe they got stabbed, you know, stabbed in the back. Didn't see it coming. But there's people behind this person that's cheering them on. Like, you could do better anyway, right? Whatever, I don't know. Yeah, they could have been on a karmic wheel for a minute. Karmic wheel, a lot of bad things happening. One thing after the other for a minute. Every now and then, guys, we all get that wheel, right? Whether it's in love or just life in general. We get a lot of ups and we get a lot of down. Whatever this was, this was a lot of burden. So they could be ending something with someone. They could be ending something. Just too many burdens. They're tired of fighting. They're tired of arguing. Tired of fighting with somebody. Maybe they just keep themselves busy at work. And here's the lovers. So they could be getting off this karmic wheel and then wanting this lover's card here with you. And they probably need attention right now, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, that doesn't mean you give them that attention, right? It's King of Wands in reverse. Maybe they're not speaking up for themselves, getting what they want. Maybe they just didn't speak up for themselves. I don't know. They're definitely healing. They're in a space of healing. Something ended. It looked like they got stabbed in the back. Something happened. Uh, yeah, it looked like they got stabbed in the back. Otherwise, they seem like a good person. Whoever this person is. Page of Swords. Yeah, they could have been deceived. There was deception. Maybe they found out with this karmic will here. Maybe they found out that their person had another lover. So, because they're healing whoever this person is. Maybe that's another reason why they need immediate attention. Because their feelings are hurt. Ten of Swords. A lot of cups are reversed. So, they're not offering love to that situation anymore. But they do want to be happy. Maybe that goes here with the Six of Wands. Let's put that here. Maybe they do want to be happy. They want the Ten of Cups. They want their justice now. So they want more balance in their life. It looks like this person was cheated on. And now they're holding their feelings back because of all these burdens, dealing with all this mess. And they want new beginnings. So this person was hurt. But it is a positive person. They're very romantic, spiritual, generous, hardworking. So they do all of those things. But I think because of this ending here, it's why they need immediate attention five of wands in reverse they're tired of arguing tired of fighting there's no new beginnings if they get away clarify this lover's card queen of wands is that you is that where they're going spirit clarify the queen of wands they're over something they're over whatever this person was trying to give them for sure they're over it. They probably found out that their person was given to somebody else. King of Wands in reverse. Two of Cups. Yeah, I think they found out that their person was giving their cups to someone else. And they're healing. Four of Wands. They are hopeful, though. They're healing. Clarify this page of swords in reverse. Knight of Wands. Yeah, their person was cheating. There was deception. So... You are dealing with a very romantic person, spiritual, hardworking, diligent, all of those things, but they're hurt right now. So now that's why should we try again? So maybe they want to try things again with you. Spirit, clarify, should we try again? They don't, they're, they're walking away though, or they could be coming towards you uh, with the two of wands in reverse. Because they was betrayed. So they're coming towards you because they were betrayed. And now they're upset and they're disappointed and they're thinking and all of those other things. Five of Swords. Guys, don't forget they need immediate attention. Yeah, they're coming towards you. They want a new world now. 
because the stuff in their life was unbalanced. They keep themselves busy. Right, look, they keep themselves busy at work. Not offering love to anybody right now. Or they're not getting the love either. And then Ten of Pentacles in reverse. So. Yeah. They're walking away. Missed opportunity or whatever. Didn't reap anything from this connection. So guys, just be careful. It is a positive person. Very romantic, hardworking. But it looked like they just got their feelings hurt. And that's why it's critical for them. And it's urgent. And they need immediate attention. Do not be their rebound. I'm just saying, right? Do not be their rebound, but that's why they're thinking, should we try again? So just be careful with all that. Take it with a grain of salt or a pound of sugar. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe.